Hello there, it is Elle, back with another fucking video. I don't remember how to do an intro. Also, I am... Nice in the room. How are you guys? I'm struggling right now. Okay. So today, I'm going to be reacting to Jaguar. The... Is it an album? It's the first part of a full length album by my bitch, my future wife. Victoria Monet, okay? For the four people that watched my other video that I reacted to, um, Experience by Victoria Monet, you might be saying, Why are you wearing the same thing you were wearing in the other video? What? Oh, Elle, you're an outfit repeater! First of all, I look good in this, okay? I look good. And second of all, I feel like this shirt is like the jungle, you know? And I'm... So like Jaguar and I'm wearing black. So I feel like it fits. But anyways, I've been a fan of Victoria Monet since 2016, I believe. Uh, when I saw her on tour with Fucking Fifth Harmony, I said this in the last video, me and my brother were fucking getting lit to her fucking set. And after that, it was over, over. I've been a stan since, I've been in the tribe since then, a loyal tribe member, always out here. Anyway, I'm fucking excited for this fucking album. I've already heard Moment, Ask Like That, Dive, and Experience. So I only have like maybe five songs to listen to, which is... <laughs> if this is your first time seeing me, hi, my name is Ella, I'm black, I'm gay, welcome! If you want to follow me on my social media, they'll be down in the description. Also, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Also, if you want to send this video to Victoria Monet, I would greatly appreciate it because, again, like I said, we are going to get married. Uh, I don't know what else to say. That's my wife. Anyways, so first of all, let's go to iTunes and look at this beautiful, fucking, majestic, just, oh, she is the Jaguar. This is this is the, the side profile of this. She is a Jag, ooh, bitch chills beautiful beautiful cover i love the fucking ooh i love the moon all right here we go so i've already heard moment but hey okay when you get high and listen to listen to her songs the songs are already out it is just it is an experience it is an experience <laughs> Like, I heard die for the first time. Anyway. But let, let's go to the next one. It's called um, Big Boss. It's an interlude. Not my shit on shuffle, bro. What the fuck? Come on. Don't play with me. I feel it. Hey! Hey! So before we really get into this reaction, I just want to let you guys know that I am angry with myself that I did not mention her vocals in this video, not one time. I don't think I mentioned her vocals one time in this video and I am extremely pissed off because the way that this bitch was singing on this fucking project, magic, just fucking magic. And I want to personally apologize for not vocalizing that, but she sings like a goddess. That's all. That's it. Oh, what I tell you? Dive? Ooh, it awakens. It awakens something in me. As an official switch now, I feel so much more comfortable singing along with Victoria Monet because I am a stud, as you can see. I am mask for the most part. No, I am mask. Yes. 
but also. So. <laughs> Okay, next track is We Might Be Falling In Love Interlude. Not a U-Haul. Not a U-Haul. Ooh, she talking about that gay shit. Not a U-Haul. Not a U-Haul. What do you say when you see? What do you say when you see two lesbians moving in after the first date? Not you, huh? Wow! Wow! I almost got it. It was almost there. It was almost there. Hold on! Hold on! Give me a second! Give me a second, okay? Cause that was that was that was some gay shit. That was some gay shit. Who you talking about, sis? <laughs> okay, that was Jaguar. Let's let's go. Oh, she said pussy cat. I was like supersonic pussy. <laughs> I have supersonic pussy hearing. Anyway. Ma'am, please. So I'm about to be fucked up is, what, is what's gonna happen. You're gonna see me get fucked up. Hey! Ooh. Ooh! That's a Kate Lottie song. I'm screaming. Come on, horns! Bro. Nasty, bro. That's disgusting. Ugh. Okay, before she goes on, I just want to say that if you ever hear a, a horn break like that or a violin break, like a sick, like smooth violin break, that is that Victoria is Monet in your speakers, speakers, honey. Because she, that is her, another signature shit thing that she does. It's just, it gives you a vibe. It gives you just like a, like a flowy underwater vibe. That's fucking Victoria Monet. An island, like breeze. What well, like just that is that's Victoria Monet, okay? If you hear that, you know she was producing on that shit, bitch. <sighs> I love her. I love this woman so much. I can't get over Climb Your Wood, period. I and like it says, written by Victoria Monet, period. That's it. That's all. Bro. Bro, she is so fucking talented. This is my, she, that's my bitch. I feel, I love her. Ooh. Um, I reacted to that. So if you want to go watch that, feel free. Um, Experience is such a good song. What is, what? There we go. It's a great song. Experience is top tier when it comes to just groovy songs. The fucking roller rink shit. Perfect. Oh! Bitch, this is my shit! Like, like, who, who's doing that? Who's doing that? Who's doing that? No one. No one is doing it. Ass like that. Not her making a song about how she built up her ass in the gym. The way she's that bitch. Like, 
What else am I supposed to say? And she's by bit the power. The power this black woman has over me. The grace, the elegance, the humility. I feel like she doesn't boast a lot about what she does. But baby, you're that girl, sis. You're that girl. An underrated genius. Next is Go There With You. Right off the bat, it's like, nice. I told you, she, she creates a vibe. That is just that vibe that's just like, it feels like you're sitting on a couch and you're just like relaxing and things are moving and you're, it, that's the, the, that's the vibe. And I fuck with it. Heavy. Bro. <laughs> I was not expecting that. She does this thing where it'll be like this flowy vibe, you know, you just be like kind of chilling, you know, and then all of a sudden she'll be like, doo -doo -doo -doo, and she'll do some other things. She'll be like, okay, sis. It makes you go like, ooh, like what the fuck? Hey. The way I just thought about doing the most disgusting shit during that whole guitar solo. The sexy. The sexy. Am I saying that correct? Are you hearing me correctly? Ma'am, the way I was transported into another dimension during that guitar solo. The way that was probably the sexiest thing I've heard to date. That's another word I haven't used yet. Sexy. Her whole vibe. That's what that's what it is. It's sexy. Um, that's what that I Wow. The way I was transported. Anyway. Here comes that guitar again. I'm I'm fed up. I'm fed up. Okay? I'm tired. I'm tired. <laughs> Cause what the fuck? Okay, last one is touch me. Let's go. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna be honest and say that I saw the tweet. I saw the tweet that Kaylani tweeted and then I saw the, the fucking retweet that Victoria tweeted when she said this song is blatantly about Kaylani. It's blatantly about Kaylani. And me and Maya, I don't know if you, if you guys know Maya, uh, her name Kiyoshi Warrior on YouTube, she's my best friend. We were talking about Victoria Monet and Kaylani. Just try to imagine it. Think about who Kaylani is. And then think about who Victoria Monet is. And then think about them together. Just think about it. Think about it for one second. I'll give you a second. Yeah, I know. You passed out, right? Because what? Are you kidding? And they're just big and bold with it. They're putting it in our... They're like, yeah. She, I, I fell in love with that bitch. <laughs> All right. She fell in love with me. Pick. The way I can't handle it. The way I can't handle this. If you love me, if you love me, they were in love, bro. Y'all, my pussy said, hey, because went from me under you to you under me. Can you say switch energy, baby? Huh? I think I'm in love.
She is sprung. She was super wrong. I'm crying. If you love me, show me. Aw, the major chord at the end. Uh, bro. Aw. <laughs> it was like, it felt so hopeful at the end because I know how it turned out for, for her and what she said about it, but the way that it just... Like... And that's the end of the... Oh, <laughs> I love this. I love Victoria Monet. That was adorable. She fell in love. She fell in love with Kehlani. What a time to be alive. Again, let, think about it for a second. Kehlani and Victoria Monet. Together. Why didn't the world explode? The aura, <laughs> the energy, the chakras, the moon alignment, the stars, the astrology. Is that why 2020 is happening? They didn't end up together. So 2020 said, oh, we gonna fuck your shit up. Wow, y'all broke 2020's heart. Wow, I get it now, I understand, I understand it now. But you know what? If it didn't work, it doesn't work, but you know. It's fine. They probably still got so much love for each other. Not her saying to keep her nails short when Kehlani has said multiple times to the public that you know when she's dating a woman because she doesn't wear nails. Something along those lines. <laughs> I love them both. She's so talented. I can feel myself starting to cry. Why am I crying? Um, She's so talented and just so beautiful and I'm really about to fucking start crying. Yikes. I just love Victoria Monet. That's all. I really love her. Uh, I think she's highly underrated and stream the fuck out of this uh, fucking album, please. Victoria Monet deserves way more credit. Way, way more. Like, she's just a hit maker. She is a hit maker, period. And she deserves more credit than she's getting right now. Um, because I don't want to, I don't want to look on a tag of her and see her best friend. I don't want to do that. I want to see her. I want to see the work that she's done with her face on it. That's what I want to see. And no disrespect to Ariana Grande at all because I love Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande, another bad bitch. Bad bitch. But these people out here, I don't want to, I don't, I want to look up a fucking black woman's tag on any social media and see her. I don't want to see somebody else. Especially with a pen like that. With a producer bag like that. With a voice like that. With beauty like that. With intelligence like, no. I don't want to see, I, mm -hmm, cause that irritates the fuck out of me. Anyway, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.